welcome back to my channel. I'm Kylie if you're new here. I'm 25 and I'm currently living in Maryland just right outside of DC and I'm so happy that you're here. Today's video is going to be a day in my life. It's just another day in December so oh and make sure you are subscribed to my channel like this video. It helps my channel out and turn on those post notifications so you know when I post next. Let's just get into today's video. It is early in the morning and I'm sorry my voice sounds like this. I don't know why. It might just be my morning voice, but I have yet to have breakfast. I'm currently working from home still. I have been doing a little bit of that and I thought I would just say hello to you guys. And Will and I got Panera yesterday and when we got Panera, we decided let's get some bagels for the week. So. I have a Panera bagel sitting for me in the kitchen and I'm really excited about it. So I'm going to go and make some breakfast. I'm going to make a bagel and I'm going to make some coffee and I'm just so happy to have you guys here to be following along on my day in my life and I appreciate all of you. So I'm going to go make my breakfast and I will talk to you guys soon. It's a bit later and I feel like there's a huge glare on these. So I'm gonna take them off, but I feel like I can't talk today. I feel like I look different than when I was originally talking to you guys earlier because I added my flannel on top. I got a little cold and then I'm also wearing my blue light glasses, which I feel like glasses can tend to make someone look completely different. That's just my opinion, but I have these ones from Key. I've just been working and trying to get some stuff done. I don't know if I've said this in like any of my other videos, but this is like my busy season of work. So it kind of can get stressful. So I'm just trying to do the best that I can to get everything done. And yeah, so I'm trying to stay on task and productive. Um, did I just say productive? I feel like... During the workday, I just get really brain dead and <laughs> I like forget how to talk. Also, it doesn't help that we're working from home and I just barely talk to anyone in general besides Will so and my dog. I mean, sometimes I'll be in meetings, but for the most part, I don't really talk. That's the, that's the deal. That's what's going on. Random fact, I keep this Laneige lip mask on my desk because, you know, it feels like I'm pampering myself when I'm working, when I put on a lip mask and I'm just like got this you're good i don't know if you're new to my channel or if you haven't been watching my recent videos i moved and um which if you haven't seen any of those videos you should definitely check them out i'll link them up in a card somewhere up there but i haven't been working in this office for a while i've just been trying to find my spot to work at in this house since will and i are just staying here momentarily 
but I was working at a desk upstairs for a little bit and I kind of like this area now. I have a monitor. I can kind of just spread out a little bit more. So I brought some desk supplies down to make it feel like a little bit more of a work environment and like if I need anything, it's here type of thing. I don't know. So I'll show you what my like favorite desk supplies are that I brought down. So these are a must. I absolutely love these. I actually think I need to buy another pack because some of them are getting dry. I don't know if it's just because I'm using them or if they're old, but these, they're the Zebra Mild Liners and they're highlighters, but they have like a highlighter tip and then they also have a small tip on the other side that you can use like as a marker. And I initially got these for my bullet journal because I love bullet journaling and stuff like that. But I tend to also really like these for work, for when you're taking notes or something like that. So I really recommend these. And another tip, they're good for Bibles because they are very like light highlight and not like they don't saturate the paper a lot. So it's good for your Bible. Another thing I brought down here was just some colored pens. So these are the Stabilo fine liners. And I also have these for my bullet journal, but I also like using them for work. And I just, I like to use these around like holidays so I can use like the red and green color in my book and then just feel like a little bit more festive or something like that. But these are a good set of pens as well. I really like them. And then I brought down this pencil pouch with just like a few of my favorite pens and I left the rest upstairs. But these pens, which I got off of Amazon, Kristen Johns recommended these pens and I just think that they're the cutest pens. I also really like the way that they write. I only have two down here, but I think they're called Keiko Green. I don't know, but they look like this. And they just have like this smooth, like, feel to them when you write and I don't know I just really like them and then my other like favorite pen is the paper mate ink joy gel this is just if I want like a gel pen to write with and it doesn't smudge so I really like that this is the 0.7 one and I really like these for like taking notes and stuff for work as well and I also have this tablet which it just says notes, thoughts, ideas, etc. And I got this from like TJ Maxx or Home Goods. I think it was actually Home Goods. I just like the paper. Oh, it has like gold edges. And then the paper has, you can put the date at the top and then it just has a bunch of lines. Yeah, it's just a standard notebook. Um, it's nothing fancy by all means, but I really like spiral bound notebooks and I always buy this type of notebook for work and just to write things down. Um, I just find it's like the perfect size and stuff like that. So that was my work haul. Oh, and I also always keep lotion in case my hands get dry or something. I can't stand it when my hands are dry and it's also that season. And so I thought I would put a festive little lotion on my desk this is the winter candy apple one i got this a few years ago so yeah that was my little work supplies haul i hope you enjoyed it i'm going to get back to work now and try to get some stuff done and hope that today just is productive and i hope that you are all having a great day and i also really need to go get some water so also if you're watching this this is a reminder to drink some water <laughs> but yeah i'm gonna get back to work It's about 1.30 and I'm just working still. Surprise, surprise. But I thought I would check in and I tried earlier to not make another coffee because I made my coffee earlier and I just felt like I didn't need one at like 11. So I started drinking my, it's orange and cream, just sparkling water. And it literally 
has basically like nothing in it it tastes so sweet i get these at walmart i have to remember that there's a walmart near me now and then i can go and get more um because i always like don't drink them and save them but like now i live close to a walmart i used to not when i lived at my apartment but i was watching one of tara michelle's videos and she was making matcha and then i had this realization that it has been a really long time since i've made matcha and i don't know why like i think i've just been drinking coffee and just like forgetting about my love for matcha so that really like got me in the mood and she's doing this whole thing with her vlogmas where she got this like matcha advent calendar and so each day she gets to try a new one so that really put me in the mood for matcha so i feel like i need to go make some so i might go do that but yeah i just wanted to check in i'm still stressed i still have a lot of work to do but we are pushing through so tonight i need to go get groceries i made my grocery list for tonight i think i need to just finish it up a little bit i have like a few things that i need to look at to make sure that we don't need but will and i our plan is to go and see my family and to be responsible we want to get a covid test to just make sure obviously like you, you never know we scheduled a test for today and the reason why we plan on going this weekend is because we usually spend christmas with his family and we kind of wanted to spread them out between the families so because of covid we didn't want to go from one family to another like family hopping or whatever so that's why we're going to my family and then there'll be like a two-week wait until we're there for christmas that is the plan and yeah so today we're getting covid tested i have not gotten a test yet i mean it's now december and i haven't had to or needed to get a test so i'm kind of nervous it kind of freaks me out so yeah we're getting covid tested and i'm kind of scared <laughs> I'm gonna make that matcha because I think I could use some extra energy and caffeine and then I'm going to get back to work. <laughs> Hello guys, so I am finishing up work. I just need to send this email. Okay, actually wait, maybe one more thing. Let me just check one more thing. Another email and then I'm done but i wanted to just get on here and chat i think i was gonna make dinner for will and i tonight but i'm getting off work a little bit later than we would have liked for me to be able to make the dinner so i think we're just going to maybe get something while we're out because i want to go to marshall's before we go get our tests done and we also have to go to the grocery store so i'm going to finish all of this up and then get my shoes on so that we can head out the door and get a move on with our day i might work a little bit more later tonight i don't know i also really want to wrap will's christmas presents a lot of them have come in and i don't want to have to deal with trying to hide them i'd rather just wrap them and put them under the tree and i feel like a christmas tree looks better when there's gifts under it so i want to wrap those gifts tonight so that he doesn't know what he's getting and i can just put them under the tree so i'm going to like i said finish this email for the fifth time i like to always just get done as much as i can at the end of the day i feel like sometimes people can be lazy at the end of the work day but i feel like i'm productive i get like a lot of stuff done still i don't know maybe that's just me okay we're here they put us in the same room i'm so scared hello guys it has been a long time since i've checked in so will and i went to go get our covid tests and they said that it would be two hours so then we proceeded to go pick up our groceries and drop them off at home and we just got done getting our covid tests my nose hurts from it well, like fine. Just trying to let people maybe not be too worried. Maybe she just like didn't stick it up as far. But I was laughing. Like my eyes Yeah, Will was watering. laughing. I mean it's it's not like horrible. She said we didn't get like the horrible test that like goes to your brain. We did that. And we got the COVID test and now we're at Chick-fil-A and we're getting dinner. Oh, come to the pickup area. 
Inside? Yeah. I have a quick question for your YouTube friends. What? Does you does Chick Fil A need to do something like special with their foods? Like whether it's like like a teriyaki chicken dish or something like. Oh, something like should different. they like spruce up their menu? Maybe, like I'm not, maybe not like something that stays on the menu permanently, but like a limited time thing. I don't okay. see why not. They have so many sauces. They yeah, but I feel like their their menu is just so solid that they like don't want to mess with it. And they don't want to be like a chain. Or something. Always changing things. Yeah, yeah, I get that. But like, I don't know. It would be nice. Will's thought of the day. So yeah, we went to the grocery store and before we were gonna go get COVID tests, we went to Marshall's and we picked up a bunch of stuff for Mika for Christmas, which is so cute. I'm so excited and like fun tip of the day or whatever from me, get your dog toys at like Home Goods, TJ Maxx, mm -hmm. Marshalls, they're like half the price is what they would be at like Target or literally anywhere else. We got so many toys there for like $5. And if your dog's just gonna rip it up, then what's the point of paying so much money for a dog toy, you know? Yeah. So yeah, still waiting for Chick-fil-A. I got grilled nuggets and we're sharing some fries and we're sharing the peppermint milkshake. The, whatever the seasonal one is right now. So I'm really excited. Pe peppermint chip. Peppermint chip milkshake. I tried it once last year and it was so good. So I'm really excited. We're treating ourselves to that from getting the test. <laughs> I was so nervous. I don't think like, I, I'm not, I'm never nervous for like shots or like getting anything done like that or like getting blood drawn. But when you stick something on my nose, like I just, I don't, I don't know, it makes me nervous. So I'm gonna go because I think I just saw them set our food down. Will's gonna go get it, and we're gonna enjoy our Chick-fil-A. Okay, we just made it home. What a day. We ate our Chipotle. That's not right. Chick-fil-A in the car. We just wanted to eat it before it got cold, even though we live like 10 minutes away. But I just feel like I've been like, go, go, go ever since we left after work. I'm going to sit down and wrap some Christmas presents. So I'm just trying to look for the supplies. Because Will was doing it on this table. So maybe I'll do it over here. Okay, so as I was saying earlier, I'm going to start wrapping some Christmas presents just to get it over with. To get presents under the tree to make it look festive. And I've realized that the main person that I'm like shopping for is Will this year. We're doing like a, not a big Christmas, if that makes sense. Like we're just trying to cut back this year in budget but it looks like everything but one of his things has arrived including all of his stocking stuff except like i'm obviously gonna go to target and get like candy and stuff for his stocking but yeah i'm going to start wrapping and i'm thinking of doing like stocking stuffers in one wrapping paper and then other gifts in a different wrapping paper i really like this one but i'm also conflicted because i got some clothing items and I don't have like boxes to put them in so I feel like I should maybe wait until I get those to wrap those all I found was this and it may work for one of the things but I don't know so I'm in a predicament with that so yeah I'm going to I guess figure out what I'm going to wrap tonight I really like this paper though, and then I'm going to use, it looks like this. I'm gonna just rip aside because this paper has gone through a lot. This is what the other paper looks like. It just says peace, love, joy on it. And then this one says with love from Santa. And I thought that was adorable. Both of these I believe are from Target. That one we had last year. This one we just got new this year. The sugar paper brand of stuff at Target is my favorite. Okay. I'm gonna get to work, be Santa's little helper, and I'm gonna catch up on some Vlogmas videos and wrap up. Jingle bells ringing in my ear. Jingle bell a sound that's Snowman is all around town. Watch out for rain, these are falling down. We stay up, wait. 
the chimney at the speed of light While we're dancing around the Christmas tree Hugging and kissing just you and me I'm coming on here a few days later to end off the video. I don't know if I just lost the footage or if I just simply did not record anything after I wrapped the gifts, but I wanted to come on here and end off the video. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate all of you. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you have your post notifications turned on. Make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!